One mile time trial in the Nike Vaporflies. Okay, these shoes are made for marathons and half marathons, not one mile time trials, but I'm just curious how they're gonna feel, how they're gonna perform on a road. P.S. I did a one mile tri time trial at a track across the street, but it's closed because school is in session. So I was hoping to do this on a track today, but instead I'm gonna do it on a road. Here in City Park in Denver, Colorado. All right, let's get these on. Let's do this. See how fast they go. See how fast they go. They feel even better this week. Almost forgot to mention, I did a 10K time trial in these shoes five days ago. Go check it out after you watch this video. All right, gotta go do a warm up. I'll be right back. It's open. It's open. Okay. I wonder how long it's open. This is good news, folks. The track is open. No public use during school hours and organizing. Oh boy. The track is technically not open, but I just talked to the coach and she said, you look like a runner, you can, you can, you can run. There's a couple other runners out here. So anyway, I think I'm gonna do this time trial on the track in the Nike Vaporfly 4% Fly Knits, but um, I'm trying to decide. We're going track. I better get this done because uh, here comes the rain. Last time I was here on this very track and did a time trial, it was in July, so it was about 85 degrees. Today it's, you know, in the upper 30s and it's raining. Not the ideal conditions, but that's okay. Basically, I am hoping to break 452 and probably, hopefully, go faster. So I'm gonna carry the GoPro with me during the time trial, give you an update as often as I can. And uh, again, I'm in the naked, <laughs> I'm not naked, it's too cold to be naked. I'm in the Nike Vaporflies 4% fly nets that just came out last week, and I am excited. It's a wet track, hopefully I don't crash. Got a little faster, not much, but a little faster. All right, let me get back to the car. I'll tell you how it went in these shoes. Pretty fun stuff on the track. I need to do some speed training. Oh, that hurt real bad. You know that deep lung burn, like the deep? That's what I got right now. That was just a mile. Oh man. Sorry, I did not film as much as I had hoped during the actual time trial. I was, I was pumping my arms too hard. I, I tried as best I could, but I was hoping to film a lot more, but obviously I was focused on trying to run fast in the Nike Vaporflies 4%. <laughs> Fly knit. Oh, it's a lot. There's a lot of words in that. All right, if you made it this far in the video, drop a four down in the comments for the 4% or answer this question of the day. Do you own a pair? What do you think? I thought they felt great on the roads when I did the 10K time trial last week, but on the track, 
trying to run under five minute pace. They felt a little clunky, uh, I, you know, they, the, which is probably to be expected. The shoe is made for half marathons and marathons. So anyway, just felt a little clunky today, but they, they were not slipping at all on the track and the track was wet. So that was a bonus. The fly knit upper was great and um, just felt a little clunky as I was trying to dig. So anyway, just a thought. Thanks for commenting and thanks for being here, folks. Hit the subscribe button, hit the subscribe button. Thank <laughs> you.